Hi, I'm Sharon Salzberg, and we're going to do some loving kindness practice together. We're brought together by the Insight Meditation Society. Somehow it seems like a breath ago that, that I was here doing this with you all. Uh, but time is quite elastic these days, isn't it? It's, it's really very different. So I, in times of tremendous uncertainty or anxiety or insecurity, look for what seems stable and, and what seems reliable. And part of that for me is the power of the heart and the sense of inclusion and connection and everything that that can bring. So that's what loving kindness meditation is designed for, to return us to things we've actually known about caring, about the importance of not leaving anyone out. It returns us to the capacity or ability we have within, no matter what, to have compassion, to have loving kindness. And that's really a tremendous thing. So let's sit together. You can sit comfortably, close your eyes or not, however you feel most at ease. We'll start just by feeling the breath. You might take a few deep breaths and then allow your breath to become natural. Look at that quality of rest, just resting your attention on the feeling of the breath. And if your attention starts to wander, you get lost in thought, dwelling in the past or the future, judgment or speculation, don't worry about it. If you fall asleep, don't worry about it. We regard the next moment as the most important moment. We've already been lost. We've disconnected. Maybe we've been far, far away. That's okay. Because we have the ability to let go gently and to return our attention to that primary object. For now, the feeling of the breath. We let go and we begin again. And now we'll replace the feeling of the breath with the phrases of loving kindness. This becomes the primary object, the silent repetition of these phrases. The phrases are gift giving, they're offering, they're generosity of the spirit. And the first recipient is ourselves. So you can silently repeat phrases like, may I be safe? Be happy, be healthy, live with ease. May I be safe, be happy, be healthy, live with ease. You don't have to try to create or manufacture a special feeling. The power of the practice is in the complete wholehearted gathering of all of our attention behind one phrase at a time. And we rest our attention on one phrase at a time.
May I be safe, be happy, be healthy, live with ease. And if your attention should wander, it's really the same skill. It's fine, you can just gently let go and come back. And see if you can bring to mind a benefactor. This is someone who's helped you or inspired you. Maybe they've helped you directly. They've mentored you, they've taken care of you. Or maybe you've never met them and they've inspired you from afar. The texts say this is the one who when you think of them, you smile. Could be an adult, could be a child, could be a pet. Who makes you smile? So if someone comes to mind, you can bring them here. Get an image of them, say their name to yourself. Get a feeling for their presence and offer the phrases of loving kindness to them. May you be safe. Be happy. Be healthy. Live with ease.
And then a friend, the first friend who comes to mind. Bring them here and offer the phrases of loving kindness to them. May you be safe, be happy, be healthy, live with ease. Then we're gonna have a party, whoever comes to mind, friends, family, can gather them together as a group and offer the phrases of love and kindness to them. And then all beings everywhere, all people, all creatures, all those in existence, near and far, known and unknown, may all beings be safe, be happy, be healthy, live with ease.
And when you feel ready, you can open your eyes and we'll end the session. So thank you so much and may you be safe and happy.